All right, so for the afternoon, Otani pitched a complete game, one-hit shutout, uh, and he hit two home runs and drove in five. five. Not too shabby of a day. There are some who say it's the greatest performance in an individual day uh, in baseball history by one player. 248-539-9797. Question A. Question number A, or letter A, is was it the best day in baseball history? Number two, question B, very simple. Uh, what's performance against a Detroit team uh, do you think was the best you've ever seen? Because well, obviously yesterday ranks with both of them. And and the the hard part about the greatest day in Major League Baseball history is you you have the opportunity to have some one offs, like this. This is a one off for Shohei because I mean so far because it's his first complete game, mm-hmm. uh, and it was an opportunity to have a double header in the same game. It wasn't the same game. It was two separate games. But to be able to do what he did against the Tigers and the fact that he is having an historic year also plays a part in that. I know you've got an example of a guy that had a better single day, uh, but I think against the Detroit Tigers, this to me is the single greatest performance. There's not a lot at stake here. It's just a day in late July Mm -hmm. against a team that has no offense, very limited offense, and has no real aspirations for postseason play versus uh, a team that does. To answer my questions, I will say definitely this was not the greatest day by an individual in baseball history. Because what he did was unbelievable. Unbelievable. But he needed two games to do it. As opposed to 1971 when Rick Wise of the Philadelphia Phillies uh, threw a no-hitter and also hit two home runs, but he did it in the same game. And as great as Otani is and what he did yesterday, Otani's complete game one-hitter was against McKinstry, Green, Torkelson, Carpenter, Carpenter, Veerling, Baez, Badu, Short, and Haas where Rick Wise's no-hitter was against, oh, I don't know, Pete Rose, George Foster, Lee May, Johnny Bench, Tony Perez, Hal McRae, Dave Concepcion, and others. All right? So to me, what he did was more impressive with the one one home run. And also, he didn't strike out as many as Otani, but he only walked one guy either. So to me, again, it's a one-off. It's one game. Otani's was two games. They're, I mean, you're basically, you know, picking picking stuff away. You're nitpicking, as yeah. I'd like to do. But well, yes. Weiss got three outs though against pitchers. True. And Otani didn't. He had to face a DH. Who was the Tigers' DH yesterday? Was probably it? probably Carpenter. Who got the hit? Uh, was it Carpenter? Carpenter. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Mm, Carpenter. <laughs> Yeah, but you know what? I don't care. I, I, he was I, that lineup. The I, Tigers lineup does not compare. I, I, I know. Even <laughs> I'd rather face the Tiger lineup with a DH than the Reds lineup with a pitcher. He did get three free outs, though, sort of. Well, he wasn't a free out. That's right. <laughs> yeah. I'm just picking at you. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I mean, uh, look to me. It's basically is it one? It's one game versus two games. That's it. That's the argument. Now, as far as versus Detroit. I still think, look, we've seen historic performances before against our teams yeah. in playoffs. But what LeBron did against the Pistons at the Palace in Game 5, when not only did he just score 48 points, he scored 25 in a row. And basically uh, made it so the Pistons would not go to the NBA Finals because the series was tied. You know, they, they would have, they, Cleveland wins. 3-2, they go to Cleveland and they win in six games. We don't, we'll never know, but I'm convinced that if the Pistons win that game, they probably win game six, and if they don't, at game seven at the Palace, they win and go to the NBA Finals. 
Well, again, yeah, again, we'll never know, right? Um, and and you still run into not to take anything away from that performance. Right. I mean, LeBron took over that game. Right. Again, the difference is this is two games versus one. Right. Otani took over the game in, in the first game with his arm. Right. He took over the game in the second game mm-hmm. with his bat. Right. And what we're seeing from seeing 48 from LeBron in a playoff game, it, it's been done before. Yes, yeah, true. Right? Absolutely. Seeing what Otani did, especially in – Today's day and age, and we're talking about the DH. We're talking about you know the athletes and the, just the, the the way the game is 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 unbelievable. It's yeah, it it's, is. Rem, it's, it it's is. just absolutely unbelievable. It's remarkable. It is. What's the best performance against a Detroit team that you've ever seen? And I do think that playoffs, when the stakes are up there, that does move it up a notch. Sure, there, there, there. You can, you can. We talk about nitpicking. You can nitpick a lot of different things. Yes, and but, but I'll go back to. I know you brought up Rick Wise. I didn't see that. Um, I know. Didn't have the opportunity, uh, but I did see LeBron's. Mm-hmm. I've also seen other guys do what LeBron did. I think Bernard King had an unbelievable game against the Pistons in the playoffs at. Joe Listen, Lewis Arena. In in LeBron's defense, one of the great regarded individual p- performances for our teams is Isaiah in the fourth quarter or third quarter in Game Six of the eighty. He had twenty five points. Final. Yeah, yeah, they lost that game and the sprained ankle and all that, and they did lose that game. I mean, basically, LeBron did what Isaiah did. Yes, and it was the passing of the torch. It was over for the Pistons. Yes, mm-hmm. it was. Even though they they made but, it to the Final Four. I mean, two come more on. Years. Yesterday, what, what happened? We he's doing things that. No, we're not. I, that American baseball isn't even teaching. Okay. Correct. No, you don't even have the opportunity. <laughs> right. uh, you know, as soon as you sh- show, uh, you know, a certain aptitude for pitching, they take the bat out of your hands. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's just, it's, I, I just, it's really sinking in. Like, Otani is, he's a legend. Like I know earlier, I, I, th- I think he, it, and it's not two different sports, but it's, it is like Bo Jackson, man. We're, we're this is crazy what we're watching. 